Hello, good evening. My name is John. This is my Steam Cleaning series where I look at the games in my library. Today, I have chosen Pixel Heroes, mainly because of the subtitle Bitin' Magic, which is obviously a play on the classic game Might and Magic, which was uh, one of my favorites growing up. I have not played this game, I have no, what a, no idea what it is, I don't know who the Bitfather are, but they've got a pretty good name there, and I don't know what version 1.361 is the preferred version, but it's what's on Steam, so we are going to give it a try. Uh, boom, new game. Oh, obviously we're going to do Champion... Sorry, Campaign 1, Hard. Fools of Radiance. Okay, that's a good name. Stairway to Hell. Fear and Loathing in Pixton. Alright, let's go here. Game crashed. Uh, let's try that again. Not a good start. Sorry, Pixel Heroes. One more try. From the top. New game. Campaign Hard. There we go. Welcome to the Tavern! Some brave heroes have found their way to these far reaches, seeking treasure and glory. Hire three heroes for your epic adventure. Um. Uh, I'm gonna, oh, I can pick. I'm gonna pick this gal here. This is a full light skyward Ronin, butterfly strike, blade dance, very high dex. Okay, this is human. Oh, we'll go with the human adventure because it's boring. And he's got healing. And orb of Nau. All right, rename hero. Uh, cannot unlock. All right, we'll take that guy. Hey, Kaelin, take this gal here. Warrior is perfect. Boom. Boom, higher. Uh, all right, and we need one more hero. Uh, who is this gal here? Enchantress, perfect. She got protection and dispel. Can we choose? Higher. Alright, let's go. Why have you forsaken me? A grave mistake. Hi, guys. Oh, their party's grouping up. Excellent decision. Oh, no. Plot guy has entered the tavern. Harry Burke. Listen, Rand is nigh. Hear my words and prepare. An ancient cult has set foot in our lands. That's how Harry Burke talks. They call themselves the Son of Zdon, a created a dark elder being. They have started recruiting people for their cause all over the country. I fear they have tried to awaken something which should not look, should have left them sleeping. Something dangerous and sinister, something that might destroy us all. Spend your last days wildly as we'll meet again once the time has come for your final quest. Alright. Joe's Tower. Mustachio. Pouring. Uh, you approach an old woman, it looks like she has an adventure like it. You are my bad my old days as an adventurer. Oh, those are the days we didn't have such fancy jobs to get it to your crew, master. Back in my day, there's only warriors rogues and fancy users. Women were only allowed to become magic users. It's nice to hear things have changed nowadays. You should enjoy freedom of choice. You never know how long this air freedom will last. Well, it's very nice talking to you, old lady. Sir, me again. Uh, go. Oh, I have no quest. Oh, I can tell which way I'm going. All right. I need to talk to... Let's talk to Mustachio. Mustachio, coma beauty got no place. The mighty mustachio needs your assistance. I lost my favorite comb when I was trying to hunt down one of those pesky little monsters. I'll make sure to put your name in the credits of my autobiography when you do me this favor. The quest shall begin. We oui. accept this quest for the comb of beauty. La! I knew the mighty mustachio could count on you. Please try not to break the comb. It belonged to my grandma. Go. Uh, wait, hold on. Do I have monies? Tavern. Temple. Is that true? Hi there, I'm Shrew, cook a short air. I hope you enjoy the taste of fresh mushrooms as much as I do. Only the bestest and freshest mushrooms are worthy of being cooked by me. You probably wonder why I'm wearing the mushrooms a hat. Well, I'm a cook and I love mushrooms, it's an obvious. If I were into meat, you'd probably wear a grilled steak for a hat. And if I was into vegetables, I definitely would choose a tomato. No. Alright, blacksmith shop. Ah. Headgear. 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 Sure. Can I make buy? Buy. And... Buy. 
Oh, I already have some. Well. How do I equip? There we go. And this is three armor. This is four. Perfect. This is two armor. That's... No, it's three of that. And this is... Alright, well, slight upgrade. What else we got? We need a weapon for our gal there. Oh, there's some cool looking weapons in this game. Stuttering Blade of Beauty. Sanitary Warriors of Alright. Mediocre. Alright. That should be enough stuff. Good weapon. Boom. Let's get out of here. Let's roll. Let's go. I like this map. That's cool. Nice tree. Strange egg. There's a rather strange looking egg on the floor. Looks like someone has placed it in the nest made of branches. Look at the egg. As soon as you touch the egg, you're hissy cells. Maybe snakes are closing behind you. Oh, I see. Oh, I saw the target. Okay. Sora. Ooh, that snake. First blood. Beggars on the road. There are three guys in green shirts blocking your path. They're wearing clubs and seem aggressive. Bad luck for you. We are the famous Greenwich Brothers, and we are here to take all your precious loot. Spare yourself some trouble and hand over your belongings. Uh, I'm gonna ignore them. Your heroes just walk past these beds. Hey, what you doing? Aren't, are you ignoring us? Wait, ah, oh, come on, guys. Let's look for better, less obvious victims. Uh, no, okay. See you guys. Nice talking to you. That's, I like that way of resolving that problem. Ooh, that's creepy. Idol of Insanity. There is a bizarre idol standing on the side of the road. Two faces appear to be floating in front of it. We have a fine riddle for you. If you answer correctly, we will take wisdom on you. What do you break before you use it? Well, you use an egg, of course. Correct. We recommend scrambled eggs. I have learned... 26... Oh. Ow. 
weaknesses. Skills. Do I have mana? Can I? Oh, I can't. Okay, he's got a cooldown. Alright. Go. Next level, you can add attribute points. Cool. Alright, so what do... Um, okay, so that's how much you get. Five for every point in the... Uh, yeah, let's just go with your max stats. Let's say strength, life, and... Keep going, keep on rolling. Let's get this dungeon done. Oh, this guy is naked. Uh, two. You discover an ancient altar of great, of the greatest similar, allegedly grand wishes. Look, this looks like uh, looks like this requires average faith. Uh, Forty-nine percent chance. Yes, try. And the wish is granted. Aha! Wish for loot and a slowly scroll thunderbolt. Right? Ooh, buy lots of loot. And we have to get rid of something. All right. How do we trash it? How do we trash it later? All right. So let's look here. We've got uh, one protection. And you need light. That's an upgrade. You have no hat on. You need a fire. Crossbow. This crossbow, I think, is better. Mediocre, yeah. Uh, this is address. This is in plus four. Alright, 
So there seems to be some sort of turn order cooldown and stuff like that to do. So I can sword and then just give you the same person twice. You know, I'll trade heals. He's a bit exploity, but... He's only... Whoa, alright, so I did heal a lot. And he healed again. So I will heal again. I'll play your game, Priest. Yeah, Priest. I'll train heals every day of the week. Oh. Whew. I have a lot of items. Party healing. Six, seven. Okay, so the stats matter. Seems some better loot. Looks like someone has that for Looks like you acquired truly great dexterity. Alright, you need 45% chance. Can you do it? Caught in the trap. Try it again, Eve. There we go. Well done, Eve. Don't do anything for experience. Sundering Arbalet of Bracing Violent Hell. These are good names. Broken Knuckles of Agnosticism. <laughs> First, Arcanus of Freedom. Shiny Vestments of Indifferent. Oh man. Six items. Sheesh. Alright, drink a potion. Love it. Getting through it! Up into the uh, last room soon. Oh goodness. Alright, let's start with the mediocre spell after the Soften up a bit. So, let's do 
strength and dex. You are pretty much all around. Let's do that. And that. We're just going to pump that end up. You can be the smartest gal around. Time to kick ass. riding a tarantula. Their precious loot! Let no one escape! To battle! Warlord Gigastola. Alright. Just start off this one right now. Oh. Oh no. Tell the world of Kaelin and Eve. And that spider was basically a little hairy. Sheep and I like Larry and Harry. He's the boss of Gamma. Oh, so I gotta have to take this part. Can you drink that? No? Can I not bring you back to life? Wow! If I was alive, this would do a lot of damage. Alright, let's get rid of some of this junky stuff here. That's junk. That's junk. Party heal is tempting, but... Two more items. I don't know if I'm gonna make it back. You see a small puppy standing on the road. It looks desperate. Oh, give him food and water. I'll be scarce on the food as long as he eats and out of the bushes. Do you travel? Alright. So far, so good. Oh god, a three headed monkey! Behind you, a three headed monkey! Haha, <laughs> just kidding. We escaped from the lair of Eagle Necromancer who was friends with the animals. Do you want to help us de defeat him? Uh. 
sorry, buddy. I would love to, but I kind of have two ghosts following me. Oh no, not a wizened snail. There's a huge blue snail with a green shell standing in the road. It's gray beard, which usually stands for wisdom. True. Greetings, young adventurers! I am the old snail of wisdom. My brothers and I have been traveling to this island for centuries. We are only observe and remember we never interfere with fate. Do you seek wisdom at a special location? Uh, arcane Army. Oh, the Arcade Army, a dangerous place controlled by an alchemist who went mad during the Great War. You should prepare yourself for enemies that can stun you and make you soft. Beware of these soft. Well, beware the insane alchemists. They will powerful spells and healing abilities. Weapons infused with Phoenix Spirit can help you defeat the dark forces within. Thank you, Snail. Make it home. Make it home. Whew. Well, Mustachio looks happier. Oh, we oui, the comb that I was looking for. Thank you very much. This is for you. First quest. Alright. Let's res the superhero. Hey buddy. Um and revive heroes. Good lord. Uh, are you wearing 3D glasses with your really red eyes? Hard to say. Well, this has been Pixel Heroes Bite and Magic. That's a pretty cool game. Uh, I I like it. Seems a little a little tough in some places, but I am bigger than deep. I'm going to uh. Yeah, end it here, and uh, thank you for watching. Cheers!